Okay, we have one computer doing well. Two are doing Libra. Um, you'll notice at the very beginning of the video, this picture of my eye. And it's getting better. But I had eye surgery on it because I had such bad hooded eyes that it was blocking my vision. So, in a way, I'm having cosmetic surgery, really. But it had to be done. So I get done free. Yay! <laughs> but I've had one eye done. I've got to have the other eye done once they check this eye over and make sure it all went well. Then I can have the other eye done. And what they did was they cut off the excess skin. Then they got rid of some of the fat. And then they tightened the muscle. So hopefully it will all be good. Let's hope so. So I'll, I'll put a picture. I'll put a picture up at the very beginning so you can see. So right, Libra. What have we got for Libra this weekend, please? What have we got for Libra this weekend, please? Thank you. And once it's healed, then I can start doing the other cards again. Oh, page of cups. So you're gonna have some emotions this week. Right. Then we got the Emperor, which is like a father figure. Okay, so you've recently had a celebration. And that could be with the father figure or boss or something, but there is a celebration. Oh, and then we got petty arguments with a lot of burden on your shoulders. So there's been a lot of weight on your shoulders and you've really struggled. But these petty arguments, it, this is all coming to an end now because you've got the 10. It's all coming to an end. So whatever the petty argument was, it's coming to an end. Yeah, and don't judge me for not having nails on. I don't want to scratch my eye and make it worse. Oh, then you're going to take a bold step. And you're going to take a bold step that's beautiful. And you're this bold step you're meant to take because you're everything's going to be good at home and everything's... This is like one above the wish card. So you've got your wish and now you're enjoying it. So everything's going to be good, Libra. We like that, don't we? We do indeed. Right, let's have a look. Please confirm these cards for Libra. Please confirm these cards for Libra. Please confirm these cards for Libra. Thank you. It's not nicely having one eye, believe me. Okay. So there's a sacrifice you're going to have to make. All right. And you're meant to look at things from a different perspective. All right, we've got the king of coins. He represents finances. So in the past, I think you went to see a bank manager or someone who's really good at finances. And they did tell you, hold on to your money, okay? Because you're going to need it. Because there's going to be a new opportunity coming for you. And it's going to be a bit sad. There was sadness around you. Someone stabbed you in the back. But that's a 10 as well. So that means it's all coming to an end. But before it comes into a total end, something major is going to come along and it's going to make you rest. And it's going to change your life totally. Libra, whatever this is, it's going to change your life totally. And you've got a new opportunity coming. And you're going to take it. 
Oh my goodness, it's going to be amazing. This new opportunity coming for you guys. It's going to be amazing. It's going to be everything you ever wanted. Libra, you have to go through the bad to get to this good bit, okay? So make sure you learn your lessons from this horrible bit to this good bit. All right, let's read the cards. So we got the Emperor with the Three of Cups. So there is a celebration here, okay? What type of celebration? I'm not sure. It could be a celebration of life. It could be a celebration of receiving money. But I do feel that it's a possibility that someone left you some money or gave you some money. Okay, and they're telling you to hold on tight for that money because something's coming to an end and you're going to need it, okay? And it's very sad. I do feel as though someone has passed. And if they haven't, they're about to, okay? There's lots of petty arguments. That they're just stupid arguments, all right, which is wearing you down. It, it's just like, for God's sake, can everyone just shut up about whatever? Just stop it. It's stupid. Because you can see how stupid it is, but maybe other people can't, okay? And I feel that someone's going to try and stab you in the back, and it will be over finances, all right? And it's going to happen all of a sudden. It's just going to happen very suddenly, and you're going to take charge of it all. Okay. Once it happens, there's going to be a time of rest for you. Okay. And this rest is so well deserved and needed. Okay. So whether you were a carer for someone and you cared for them, but it's time to rest. Okay. And then you've got, even though everything's sad, you've got a new beginning coming. And this new beginning is going to be amazing because you've learned so much about yourself and others. And then you're going to take this big, bold step out into the world. It's going to be something that you haven't done before. All right? And it's going to be an opportunity <clears throat> that you thought you would never have. Okay? <clears throat> this could be why they've told you to save your money. And you're just going to go ahead. And I feel that you're going to do something that... Like Maybe you're going to meet people somewhere. Maybe you're going to be your own boss. But it's going to be the making of you, okay? But it won't happen until after you've had this time of rest, okay? You're going to look back at the past. And you're going to now understand how money works better. You're going to enjoy the finer things in life. You will enjoy the finer things in life. But you're being told you've got to be wise with your money. Okay. Don't spend it willy-nilly. You've got to look after your money. All right. But someone's going to take it from you. But you got your wish. Just seriously, guys, you've got to look after your money. And I do feel that there is going to be a passing soon, Libra. It's something that's really sad. It's because you got so many other cards together. It's just like, it's soon. If you got someone ill in the hospital, I'm just letting you know it is soon. Okay. But yeah, I want to pull out my other cards desperately, but I can't read them. It's pointless. I can only just about see these cards. So because I've worked with them for so long, and even though I'm. I just can't read them. I mean, physically read. You know, I'm having trouble even seeing this. Okay, so even the fact I know what the card looks like, but I know what that says, if you know what I mean. But anyways, guys, I hope that's helped. I really do. And I'm sorry for your loss. But as always, oh, hold on. Even though it, there's a loss, it might not be a loss of a person. Just so you understand that. It could be loss of a job. It could be a loss you know, uh, even appetite, 
but it's still a loss, okay? As always, stay truthful, be happy, and love and sparkles, Scooby-Doo!